guys, welcome back to Burns' Math Club. Today's topic is adding money. Now when it comes to adding money, all you have to do is follow these two simple steps up on the board, which are step one, align the decimal points in your money, okay? And step two is add them vertically, which means up and down, and you have your answer. So it's that simple, and this video is going to be really short, okay? So let's get started. Now up on the board, I have a word problem that says, Caitlin buys a book for $5.99 and a magazine for $2.99. What is the total cost for both items purchased? That means the total keyword tells us that we have to add. So we have first $5.99 for the book. And we have $2.99 for the magazine. All we have to do is step one, align the decimal points. So as you can see, I have aligned the decimal points right on top of each other. And step two is add vertically, which means up and down. So 9 plus 9 is 18. Carry the 1. 9 plus 9 is 18, plus the 1 is 19. 9, carry that 1, bring down the decimal point just as it is. 1 plus 5 is 6, plus 2 is 8, bring down the dollar sign, and you get your final sum of 8.98. That means Caitlin's total cost was $8.98 for both the book and the magazine. Now, I hope you guys understood the purpose for these videos, which is that to show you guys that in our everyday lives, when we use money and purchase items, we're actually using mathematics, okay? So next time you guys buy something, keep that in mind. And once again, please feel free to visit our website at burrowsmathup.com for extra practice problems on this topic or further coming up topics. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye!